I'm tearing up just writing this, in fact, I'll stop for now. That was two days ago. Okay, day two now. Jeff, people like you don't come around too often. I want to emphasize the word people, because I want to make sure no one listening thinks I'm confusing it with student. When we say student, oftentimes we think of many of the stereotypes that come with that word, and not all of them are necessarily bad. Of course, there are ones like, and this is a stretch in some cases, as I'm sure your parents know and feel, innocent, trusting, obedient, vibrant, energetic. But some of them are also, though very normal and very expected, not as positive, immature, irresponsible, self-centered, inexperienced, and cocky. As we grow older, those things change. Of course, that's not the case for all people, and life has its way of weeding, uh, weeding that out in you. But what is a good person? Feel free to ask yourself that and develop your own opinion. But what makes a, what a good person is to me is someone that takes care of what they are asked and what is expected of them uh, on time and to the highest standards. It's a person that has high expectations of themselves without being told, uh, and time, oh gosh, <laughs> without being told, and again, handles it with class and perseverance. It's a person that shines on a civic level as much or more than a performance level, be it your job or school. And no kids, school is not a job, it's an experience and an opportunity. It's being a person that asks someone if they need help with anything without being told. I think it's a person that doesn't say, that's not my job, but instead says, that needs to be done. It's being exemplary in every imaginable way. Folks, Jeff is that. I said in the beginning there are a few times in a person's life they get to experience a person as selfless, determined, kind, and outstanding as Jeff. Just two days ago, I told you I potentially sold my house. And no sooner did I finish the sentence than you immediately offered to help me move. <laughs> Jeff has been bullied, poked, prodded, made fun of, <clears throat> and he gets up every time a stronger person. He has persevered through every obstacle, challenge, and hurdle, and asked, could he lend a hand the entire way? He was not a naturally gifted, uh, he was not naturally gifted uh, academically, not to say he was challenged either. I simply mean he's had to work uh, to the bone for everything he has, and I mean that in all sincerity. <clears throat> and now he has acceptance into one of the most uh, prestigious engineering schools in the country at Virginia Tech, which was his dream uh, all along. Sorry. <laughs> Jeff, I, uh, I love you dearly and I admire who you are uh, even more. And one day I hope I can get myself to a point where I see the world as you do. A beautiful place <clears throat> with a few rough patches. I can't even read this. <laughs> <laughs> Here and there, that simply need mending. As much as you love yourself and want to do what's best for you and your future, you primarily just want to make sure you leave the earth better than we found it. I've said in the past that some of the students that have graduated from this program and school are what every student should aspire to be. But you, Jeff, go beyond that. I believe everyone in this room could learn something from you by watching you live your life in all facets. You are just not what a person should be. And with that said, you are also this year's uh, FOA band.
They start with, has been called a march, uh, as perfect as a march can be, and one of the three most effective